Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of the Official Arc Podcast, number 306. My name's Coach MT, and I'm here live today with the core team. Your host for tonight, as always, the one and only Mr. Atlas. The floor is all yours, sir. Thanks for the introduction, Coach Mistletoad. And folks, welcome back for another edition of the Arc Daily Podcast. This Saturday, September 2nd. That's right, the end of the summer is upon us. Autumn, just around the corner. Seasons change. Tables turn. But the arc, my friends, continues on its journey. And what a journey is it we're going to have. Very shortly, Brent Nordine's going to give some updates. He's going to show us a sneak peek as to what the arc has been cooking we're going to let that be a surprise. So if you're watching this on YouTube, you'll be able to visually see what we're talking about. And it's related to the tarot card. We're taking a quick look now at the state of the arc. Total vault accounts are 5,601. Liquidity on Pancake Swap. Hold a steady 56,530 BUSD. ILC reserves 107,000. 947 BUSD. The price of ARC is 8 cents. Spark price pool 873.8 ARC. And today, here live, folks, we're going to find our next Spark winner as well. 10% is going to be going directly into the vault with a nitro boost to the MVP. We already know who the MVP is. Boy, they keep winning MVP over and over. We have our top 10, but at the top of the list, the wall ends in BF36. Congratulations to the MVP. He's already been selected. Sheesh. It was a great week behind us, another great week ahead of us. And the temperature just keeps rising. We're getting so close. Tarot card is is almost fully baked. We can smell it from here. We can smell it worldwide because it will be shipping all over the, the world. If we could ship it to the moon, we would. We gotta we gotta talk with uh, SpaceX. See if we can work out a deal. Get uh, the folks on the other parts of the universe their tarot card as well. But uh, before we do that, we just gotta launch here for the the Earthlings. The, uh, the humans with a pulse that are needing to use their crypto. We are understanding also that our good friends at Binance are discontinuing their cards for South America as well as the Middle East that was just announced this week. Another confirmation, another indicator, another sign that the ARC is moving in the right directions. And we're arriving into these opportunities exactly at the right time. It may seem that it takes forever to develop these things, but it's all part of a journey. It's all a part of creating quality. It's easy to go fast. It's easy to try to be out the door, but if you don't have a product that can stand the test of time, that is not gonna create a ton of issues for tech support. I think you folks already know the quality of the work that we do here how efficient it is, how reliable that you can count when you go to the DF and you're going to do your compounds where you're going to add and do your, your um, auto allocations that everything here works absolutely as expected. It's been delivered, it's been tweaked, any little bugs have been worked out. And with the launch of this new product, we're going to also rely on you, our community, our first customers with these products to give us the feedback as you've done before with the mobile application with the d app and as we continue we're always going to rely on our community and of course we want to announce it now legacy nft holders will again have the chance to get their cards before anyone else we always give the love and support to the legacy nft investors they're the ones that have really provided 
the resources. Do you think they'll get built just with great intentions and hopes or, or these people come and work with us because we're good, nice people and we're friendly? No, my friends, we have to pay. And it all comes back to the legacy of tea holders, giving us that amazing opportunity. With that, let's turn it over to Mr. Brett Nordine. Hope you're doing well today, my friend. Doing great. Yeah, we got some great news, um, some photos, and I think you were showing those off before the pod started, but we have the uh, the final packaging for the tarot cards, and everything looks cool. amazing. Uh, we are getting an insert printed on Wednesday, and so we have all of the final pieces. We have the cards, we have the metal cards, we have the, the packaging, the insert, and are you going to show those pics now? Or Yeah, yeah, I'm trying to, I just, I just loaded them up. But I don't uh, see the Hold on, maybe because I was here on this. Yeah, that's what happened. I got them in another screen. So as you speak, I'm going to go ahead and show those. So you can yeah, there's walk the, us through. yeah, that's the <laughs> sleeve or the packaging that the the card's going to be inserted inside. So we have our arc icon logo on the outside along with Terra card, and then our DeFi simplified logo. And then that's what it looks like when you open the package. So the cards nested inside the little sleeve. Yeah, it's cool. And then we're going to add an insert with little instructions in there. So and then there's a, yeah, that's the, the couple cards, a couple of the metal cards. And the silver one was inside the box there. Sheesh. So, yeah, I'm gonna Great work, it. man. Yeah, Apple, Apple doesn't do packaging like this. I'm pretty sure they, they don't. Um, the crypto.com, we've got a couple of our investors here. The crypto.com card, it doesn't come looking like this, folks. This is absolutely stunning. Look at that. Oof. Amazing yeah, work, cool. brother. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, can't wait to see the reveal videos and everybody getting excited about that. Oof. Yeah, so that, uh, that's all next week. Um, issuing the card and making sure all the smart contracts work and pushing money, money in all the right places and uh, do the final walkthrough with Alex. And hopefully we can release it to at least, like you mentioned, the, the Dow and get some initial cards. Maybe, you know, if you select people to walk through the process again, refine it even further, and then uh, we'd be ready for launch. So getting real close. Um, other than that, um, on the Arc Light side, we are working, I think I mentioned yesterday, the product landing page. And we're getting that all coded up, and um, all of the back-end coding is done. Uh, the uh, the way we're accepting funds and distributing funds and all of that is integrated. Uh, we're just going to be able to do the um, the branding now and the product landing page and things like that. So the UI just needs a little cleanup, and then we're going to do some more testing. And that'll be following the Terra card. So we're going to focus really heavily on Terra, push that, uh, make a big splash, and then we'll start to uh, talk more about ArcLight and, and uh, get that released to everybody as well. So, yep, those are the next two big milestones. Then obviously we have the privacy products. That's a huge project, but uh, we've got a big team <laughs> working on that. And uh, we'll, we'll be talking more and more about that. Yeah. Yep. So massive, that's about massive, it. Yeah, massive. looking forward to the week, getting Terra buttoned up and um, more progress on ArcLight and privacy. And then Get that Terra launched. When Terra? Soon, soon. <laughs> Very soon. Can't wait. Well, but it's nice to be able to come and, and show, right? A little sneak peek. I know the folks yeah. here have been so patient. And if uh, anybody wants to uh, unmute their mic, they want to comment uh, on your impression with the sneak peek, we always love to get the feedback. Always uh, is important to hear from, from you, our community, our investors. She's gorgeous. I want one. Thank you. Thank you so much, Amanda. I'm still deciding on what to put for, for my name, if it's going to be a mistletoe or, or just something, something else, something completely left field. Well, you'll be able to decide and... Are you, are you getting uh, just a, the, the, the metal card with, with the name, or are you getting a custom logo? 
I'll probably get the the Arc logo. I think that'll be probably pretty pretty clean. I don't know if I need a a, a Toad logo on there, <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see. Litoad. Litoad. Anyone else? You had a sneak peek before you actually get to see the whole thing unveiled. Give it another 10, 15 seconds. Tough crowd today, Coach Mistletoad. Well, Tough you know crowd. me, Atlas. I can't wait to make a video with these cars. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's a ferg. But uh, no, looking at the cards and the way it's presented, attention to detail as usual, guys. You know, these are knocking it out of the park. So I'm excited. I'm FOMO'd. I'm ready to go and buy an RMAX wallet right now. So I am because I know what's coming. Yes, sir. I'm actually going to send you, Fergie, here uh, the, the images. Uh, so you can have a, your sneak peek right right there at it. Oh, I see you got a message from you. I hadn't seen it before. Sorry about that, Fergie. Oh, you're all right. You're all right. Oh, uh, there we go. I got to check that out. Let me take a screenshot. Sometimes that's what I got to do, take a screenshot of stuff. And later, before I go to bed, I, I can catch up and see. So you got an ARC 5 video. Okay, there we go. I'm going to check that out. Push it out to our great community. Thank you. Anyone else? Oh, Donatello's in the house. We haven't seen you in a while, Mr. Donatello. Crypto Unlimited. Hello, sir. Yeah, Alice, I, I, their card, they look great. Um, I, I, we probably went over this before, but what's the going to be the cost for the fees and the loading fees? Did we go over all that yet? Uh, no, we haven't, but we'll, we'll be releasing that soon. We, we have all, all that information, but we'll release it as we get closer. Okay, thank you. i just making sure I'm keeping up to date. Yes, sir. Are you a legacy and a few holder, Johnny? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's, there's some special discounts for you. I can tell you that. <laughs> the rip. You're... Uh, you're gonna, you're gonna definitely we have some, some discounts. I'm sending you a couple here of those pictures to you as well. Let me send them also to um, here. Actually, you know what? I think we could just post it. It'll be easier for folks to be able to get to. But yeah, we haven't dropped the details yet, right, Brett? Yeah, no, we haven't. I don't think we've sent out i have all the banners and everything done mm -hmm. um so we can i guess we can start sending that stuff out we have like the, the referral commission breakdown by card so if you you know you do the plastic versus the metal versus the custom metal there's a different uh, referral commission on the card sign up side um but then you're also getting earnings on the load fees so there's a kickback on the load fees as well from any referrals that you have so yeah, it could be a nice little lucrative business uh, for people to promote the tarot card, for sure. I think that's, you know, one of the most important things that we have going for us is I, I think a lucrative referral commission system is, is going to make it, you know, make it make it go quick. Um, it's just hard, you know, like crypto.com doesn't have much of any. I don't think they, they even, don't even have a referral program, right? It's just the user base. Nobody does. No. Yeah. So, yeah, we'll, we'll get those, uh, we'll get those numbers out and we've got, uh, I thought in the FAQ, maybe we haven't updated the FAQ on the Terra card website, but I'll have to go look because I thought that we updated all those with the fees and all that stuff, but we'll, we'll have all of that finished if it's not already um, prior to launch for sure. And We'll, uh, we'll get out those banners so that you can kind of just see the referral commission structure in a snapshot and you can share it. And then you can um, use our banner for the card um, that, that just highlights the card and then put a re your referral link embedded in there on Telegram. And that way when you post it in your groups, when they click on it, um, they'll go over to, you, to the Tarot Card website. And if they sign up, then you'll automatically get the referral rewards.
straight to your wallet. Yep, yep, yep. All handled by the smart contracts. Let's go. Now, is it just the two tiers, the plastic and the metal card? The, the two tiers are on all cards. It's just um, different um, different commission levels as far as like the, the dollar amounts. So the plastic, so, you would get you would get less referral commission than on a metal, for example. So Brett, just the only NFTs we get a, a, a reward from the, the loading of these cards? Um, no, the, the NFT holders just get a discount on the load fee. Oh, okay. So unless we have people underneath us, we don't, there's no fees kicked back to the NFT holders, unless you have somebody use it by using your link. Is that how it works? Yes, there's, um, there's a discount for using your link uh, to the person that's loading the card. But then you also get a discount on the on your load fees for being an NFT holder. Okay, but then now as far as the payment, there is no discount on the payment for using somebody's. They still have to on the purchase the of the card. There's no discount for the NFT holders. Only on the load fees. Okay, thank you. Yeah, we did. We we debated that a little bit, but um, the the money's going back to the project, which ultimately would benefit the NFT holders anyway. So we were like, well, they're just kind of, if they got a discount, they're just taking away from their own reward at the end of the day. Makes sense. I can't wait to get mine. I'm still torn if I'm getting the, the gold or the silver. So there, there's actually three cards. There's a plastic, there's a metal, and then there's a custom metal, right? Yeah, there four, there's four, yeah, there's four colors of metal that you can choose from. Um, the plastic's just the black plastic with our ARC logo on it. And then if you buy the metal, you can choose between black, silver, gold, and then the rose gold. And those are all brushed. The black okay, is like a matte the, finish, but the yeah, then the, the pictures, the pictures show the brushed color. Okay, the custom metal is when you put a logo on. You can put your, you can add your logo to the custom version. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. What do you do? Just send you a pixel of the logo, just like. Yeah, need? we. Yeah, we have, we'll, we, we'll have a way to upload the artwork. And so we might have to sort some of that out because we don't know what people are going to provide to us. Um, we, we can have requirements, but then not everybody, you know, might be able to not, they, some people might not be able to deliver to the requirements. So um, we might have to help them a little bit with the artwork, depending on the logo how we receive it, um, if the resolution isn't high enough, the image size, all of those kind of things, the background colors and that kind of stuff. So there's there's already um, some requirements built into it so that the, the laser machine that does the etching on the metal can accept that version of the logo. I don't know if that makes okay. any sense, but one there's some design question. requirements. Okay, one other question, but I don't want to, I know it'll happen. If somebody loses a card, is there a fee to get a replacement card? If somebody does what? If somebody loses their card, well, is there a replacement fee? Like, yeah, there's a card for you fifty bucks if you lose your card. Yeah, there's a replacement fee for the for the card. Okay, thank you. And we'll be able to freeze the card. Like a credit card, if we it gets stolen, you can just freeze it. Yes. Yep. yep. There's a Sable. button in the card manager to uh, deactivate the card in case you lose it, or you just don't want uh, someone else to be able to use it. Okay. Now, I, as far as cards, if you're ordering them, let's say I want to get one for my wife, would that have to pay the, another four hundred dollars? 
Yes. So for additional cards, it's a, the, the same fee. Um, and you can put it under your same account, but you would have to run through the process first before uh, the entire purchase process. So you'd have to go through the KYC and then get the, pur uh, the purchase completed. And then you could um, start the process for her once that's completed. Okay, well, well, the, what I wanted to ask you is if I used one of my other addresses and put her name on there, would that be like having somebody underneath me? No, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. But Mr. Big, you don't have to spend 400 You can give her the what, $150 card or the $250 card. Yeah, okay, the 400 yeah, is just that. custom. You know, that's the but big boy flex. Her, I can put her on my other accounts so it would be like I had a referral in me too, correct? Yes. Yeah, because she's going to spend the hell out of that card. I guarantee you. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Fantastic. Happy days. Great questions, folks. And uh, yeah, I mean, pretty soon we'll we'll come. We'll we'll do a whole kind of presentation and run through. Uh, that way, we'll have some material too to to be able to disseminate, share with with other people, and and then you know give the ammunition to our great community of content creators, so so they have all of the details that can start creating the hype and, and getting folks to sign up under them. So, yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a lot of fun. We are almost ready to launch it. One last question, because maybe I didn't hear it. Uh, my wife was talking to me. What is a discount for loading when they use your link? I didn't hear what how much of it is. It's a half percent discount on the load half. fee okay. for you. the NFT holders. Mm -hmm. It's a discount. Uh, different for different NFTs? No. No, if you hold the legacy NFT, when you load crypto onto the card, the load fee is discounted by 0.5%. Yeah, so this, it doesn't go up. The discount is more bigger with each level of NFT. No, it stays the same. Okay. <coughs> Yeah. All the legacy NFTs are, are, are getting the big discount. So the little guy, the, the whales, everybody. You know, we've always tried to make sure that it was in a whale game. All right. I think it is that time. Because, Mitchell, so you don't have uh, anything because we're, we're on the pause, right, with the shorts. And we're uh, yeah. just waiting for the team to make their, their vote. So, uh, exactly. yeah, you're, 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 exactly. you're, you're letting – you're letting the uh, computer drive the plane today or the spaceship, if you want to call it that. <laughs> or, or the autopilot, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. But uh, it, it's a, it's important. It's good. Uh, I've wanted you to have a bit of a break. We don't want you to burn out. So um, we, uh, we're having Appreciate the calm it. before the storm because, boy, of it's going to be, you know, Terra and then the arc, <laughs> the arc lights coming. Boys, that's going to be huge. Really, I'm shopping for some sleep, new gloves. Eat your Cheerios. Uh, get some exercise. Get that mental health. Get your house in order, folks, because it's going to be absolutely insane. Oh, yeah. What's going to happen here? Because we're going to flip the table. I mean, we're just going to go and grab the, t the, the whole Ponzi table and just throw it up in the air. It's going to do like five somersaults and flips, and it's going to land and just break, and everybody's going to be like, holy shit. What the fuck did the Ark do here, folks? Wow. Look at Let's this. Let's go. <laughs> so get get ready. Get ready. Get your rest. You're going to need it. You're definitely going to need it, folks. And uh, let's christen the night. Beautiful Saturday with a Sparky. Who would, who would like to win the Sparky today? It is ready. Almost. Yeah. It's all set up. Let's go ahead and cue it in right here into the system. Let it refresh. And uh, let's sit back. We already, we already know everybody here how to play the game, how to win the spark. So wish you all the best of luck, folks.
There we have it. Today's lucky Spark Prize winner has been revealed. Their wall ends in 7-E-O-D. They've won a Nitro Boost of ARC directly into their vault of 792.84 ARC. And they, my friends, are a first-time winner. It happens yet again. Sheesh. Boy, it feels good. First time. Nitro boost. NDV through the roof. The gauge is going all the way to the top. The glass is almost shattering of the power of this Nitro boost. And, of course, the MVP, their wallet ends in BF36, 89.09 arc straight to the vault. Bye, bye, bye. Sheesh. Congratulations to both winners. For today, and folks, everybody here is a winner. Every single day on the arc, you've got a winning team here working effort, like effortlessly focused, concentrated, not giving an inch. We're here to build, we're here to co create, we're here to win. It doesn't happen overnight. You have to go through the struggle, but you have to continue on the path. And that's the only way, folks. So together, we will reach the top. We will get there. It's just a matter of time and putting in the work. And boy, do we have a great time putting in that work and getting the win. We're going to thank all of you for being here today on this Saturday. We're going to be back tomorrow, Sunday, 4 p.m. EST, 8 p.m. UGC for the Sunday sessions. We wish you all a great rest of your day. May you enjoy your travels on this fantastic spaceship we call planet Earth. Be safe out there. Take care of each other. Be good to yourselves. And we'll see you all tomorrow.